Hello friends, welcome to my channel Rad Android. In this tutorial, we learn the frame layout. Before the starting this tutorial, please subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon button to get new videos notification. So, friends, frame layout is one of the simplest layout to organize view controls. They are designed to bl blocks an area on the screen. Frame layout should be used to hold the child views because it can be difficult to display single views at a specific area on the screen without overlapping each other. We add multiple children to a frame layout and control their position by assigning gravity to each child using the Android layout gravity attribute. So friends, suppose our, our layout is this type and we are using a frame layout so our attributes uh, of UI elements are settled in that way means in this top of left top of right top of center bottom of left bottom of right bottom of center and if you are adding your elements in the center that is that is a center center right center left in that way our ui elements are let's do in our layout so let's start the actual implementation of here we simply we design some buttons in frame layout so change this layout to relate uh, frame layout is frame layout and add one another attribute in layout that is the major all children's in frame layout that anyway, this is the de determined whether to measure all children's including those that visibility or just those which are in visible or invisible state of measuring visibility the default value of measure all children is false this can set value in the form of boolean that is true or false this may be also be referred to re resource containing a value this type so add here measure all children equal to true and set id for this frame layout that is frame we are using this layout in activity dot java file to measure the height and width of our layout so simply add here buttons wrap content wrap content set id id bt1 and here we add here gravity for where to use to uh, store the our this button in a layout so layout gravity top of left here you are set a button in top of left that is add text here top of left so I want to copy this code to reduce to code fast so here change your id to 2 and uh, here change to center and change our code is center here so copy again this code change id 3 top of right and change the text top of right so again we add this code for set this set this button in the center left center left center left again add this code for add code this to center and here add text to center 
and for center right center right right we'll add center right here center of right and change id to 6 again we set this ui element in bottom of frame so bottom left bottom left and set for bottom center bottom center and last is bottom right bottom right so here change code bottom of right here you can see here our code is now ready so you can see here no space in two elements so simply i want to reduce the code or in the text of this buttons so so you can see our uh, ui elements in frame layouts so simply you can see here frame layout designing part so go on this main icon.java file here also uh, already i uh, added frame layout uh, object and buttons object so simply add here frame layout equal to request here frame layout find view by id dot r dot id dot frame and here for buttons button bg1 equal to button find view by id r dot id dot button 1 and for remaining buttons use same code for so here change on the way object button 2 button 3 or button 4 for button 5 button 6 or button 7 8 9 7 8 9 change the buttons IDs button 2 button 3 button 4 button 5 button 6 button 7 button 8 button 9 so our code is ready it is the uh, type casting complete and now ideas are finally here so simply uh, we are measures all all children that is all ui elements in frame to calculate the width and height of our frame layout so there use frame layout dot major of view major of view dot view dot dot major spec major spec dot unspecified unspecified comma view dot major spec 
डॉट अनस्पेसिफाइड व्यू डॉट मेजर स्टेक डॉट अनस्पेसिफाइड ओके ऑल राइट देन यर कैलकुलेट विथ देन हाइट ऑफ और फ्रेम फ्रेम्स सो यर एंड वन आर थिंग दैट इज द फाइनल इंच हाइट इक्वल टू फ्रेम लेआउट डॉट फ्रेम लेआउट डॉट गेट मेजर विथ गेट मेजर हाइट और हाइट हाइट एंड फॉर विथ फाइनल इंच विथ इक्वल टू फ्रेम लेआउट डॉट गेट विथ एंड सिंपली हेयर फॉर then finally make a toast for to display a height and width of our frame layout so set any button in this frame layout i want to add a center button button of this layout to show the height and width of this layout so our button 5 is the center of center button in the layout so detn5 dots on set on click listener new view dot on click listener in on click method simply make a toast toast dot make text get application context comma here set width equal to plus width and for height height equal to set here height comma toast dot set is length dot short and dot show okay then run this application here you can see the output of this frame layout so if you click on center button you can see the height and width of this layout this width of layout is 494 and height is 168 it is it measures all changes in layout for example we if we set visibility of view we be gone and set major all changes property to be true then it is also it will 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 also count to that view which is not visible but if we set the major's all children's property to false then it will not be count that the view which is gone so if you are not subscribed my channel please subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon button to get news notification thank you